What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt Deville with Counterpunch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Tyson, the Gypsy King Fury. Get this. Tyson Fury voices his opinion on Joshua's next opponent, Jermaine Franklin. And this is what he had to say. He said, I like Jermaine Franklin. He did really well in his last fight. I was very impressed, and he even trained at my gym for four or five weeks down in Moore Camp. I think he's a real contender. He's an old school throwback heavyweight. Hmm. Those are the words of Tyson the Gypsy King Fury. And let me counterpunch. Um <laughs> Tyson Fury is one of those guys with a million different personalities. And in this personality, you know, every so often you will catch that personality that's calm, that's sensible, that's uh humble. That's um, that just speaks with sound judgment and sound mind and like he's really just relaxed. And he showed much respect to Jermaine Franklin. I have to agree with him. Jermaine Franklin impressed me as well. So I'm with Tyson Fury. You know, um, I think that Jermaine Franklin, but, you know, deserves exactly what he gets. If he gets the Joshua fight, which I hope he does at this point. You know, I'll be happy for him. Win, lose, or draw. Especially win because he's American. You know what I mean? And we don't have any American contenders. All of them get popped or make a hundred excuses on why they lost and all that shit. So Jermaine Franklin is contrary to every other American fighter that we have. So it's like, hey, he at least he's a new player in the game that can give a new challenge to some old warriors or some former champions like Anthony Joshua. You know, but speaking of AJ... Right. And I look at things like this. We've heard what Tyson Fury said. Right. You heard me read verbatim what he said about Jermaine Franklin. I look at also the things that he didn't say. What did he say? He didn't say he thought thinks that he beats Joshua. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Normally, you know, you would think he like he just said he's an old school fighter. He trained at my gym. He did a good job. You know, I like him. Right. But then he didn't say, OK, the elephant in the room was what? He's fighting AJ. So he had no prediction on AJ. He didn't say the bodybuilder. He didn't say he'll upset him. He didn't say he'll beat him. He didn't say anything. He just gave his quick analysis and breakdown on Jermaine Franklin. I just find that mighty strange because, you know, normally if you leave any counter for Tyson Fury to come at AJ, he takes but why didn't he take it this particular time? Because I think that particular personality wasn't uh, didn't have bias. Because I think at some times Tyson Fury comes with this personality where he knows not to say certain things because it just doesn't even make any sense and he just doesn't believe it. I think Tyson Fury talks shit mainly to piss people off and get in their heads and to promote a particular event. I think he does that for that reason, but he's not promoting anything because he has nothing to do with Anthony Joshua nor Jermaine Franklin, you know, and since he doesn't have anything to do with it, and since he knows that AJ is normally no, more than likely going to knock out Jermaine Franklin, why would you talk that up? Or should I say talk that down, right? But anyway, you guys tell me what you think of Tyson Fury and his response to AJ's next opponent, Jermaine Franklin. Of course, please subscribe. And you guys been Counterpunch. Peace.